cutting the show for y'all. Got a damn good show. RFK Jr. Yeah, I know he's a Clinton loving. Yeah, he endorsed Hillary. Yeah, we love him some Hillary Clinton boy. Well, when she was running against uh, Trump, of all people, he endorsed Hillary Clinton. Yeah. Wait, wait, there's been a rele- uh What's the word? It's been a revelation. There you go. So it's been a like revelation. It. It's been a revelation. <laughs> he copped to. Well, here, check out the video. <laughs> I'm Jeffrey Epstein's jet. Were you? Yeah, I was on Jeffrey Epstein's jet two times. I was on it uh, in 1993, and I was on it in, and I went to Florida with my wife and uh, two children to visit my mom over Easter. Um, my my wife had some kind of relationship with Glenn Maxwell, and. They offered us a ride to Palm Beach, so I went then, and then on another occasion, I flew again with my family, with I think four of my children, and um, and uh, and Mary, my wife, to Rapid City, South Dakota, to go fossil hunting I, uh, for a weekend. And uh, but other, otherwise, I was I was never on his jet alone. I you know I've been very open about this from the beginning. This was in 93, so it was 30 years ago. It was before anybody knew about Jeffrey Epstein's, uh, you know, his nefarious issues. And I agree with you that these, all of this information should be released. Um, and we, we should get real answers on what happened to Jeffrey Epstein and any of the high-level political people that he was uh, involved with, all of that should be open to the public. It should be absolutely transparent. And, you know, I don't see why any of those records would have any redactions in them. Why would we be hiding that from the American public? Well, you I think might Listen to that dude talk is exhausted. Yeah. You can get used to it, though. I already got used to it. Just got to keep looking at his videos. It's kind of exhausting to me. Yeah, at first it's, it's like, it's like it's watching exhausting. somebody run a marathon. You think it's that bad? Yeah, it's not, uh, it's not pleasing. You know that. But uh, anyway, well, at least he's honest. I, mean, yeah, it's not, I believe him. Yeah. Still not going to vote for him, but I believe him. Well, his wife. Did he say his girlfriend or whatever had a uh, relationship with uh, Jelaine? Just yeah, lying. he said that. You know what? I think his wife needs to be investigated. <laughs> Sound like he was just doing some family trips, but why don't you just he's... take a regular plane? Why had to get on that low yeah, to express? <laughs> <laughs> I don't get it. I mean, you, you were Kennedy. I mean, don't you have uh, the means, the resources yeah. to, like, take your own flights? You're like a private jet. He's a politician. But now y'all see why um, the, the list, Epstein's class, you see why that list has not been, like, released, like all the, the Johns and stuff? Well, you see why that information has not, not been released? Well, let me, let me put it to you like this, all right? Now, a lot of powerful people. He keep us talking. Plan. I was talking. You keep talking. Okay, let me talk. Yeah. Like you said, nobody know, knew about his nefarious activities, right? So it would unfairly disparage a lot of people. Hey, Kevin, I've been around some crooks, some shady people. I figured that out in five seconds. Yeah, me too, man, but n not everybody's bright as me and you. Sometimes it takes people a little while. There's a lot of stupid people out there. <laughs> like me and you, me and you are very clever, very smart and bright. You know, very intelligent people, me and you are. Most of these people, man, I mean, the thing hey, I'm talking. Most of these people out there, man, they got stewards for brains. Yeah. Like, I can look at a politician right now because I've, I've, I've did my research. I actually listened, and I took out, wait, I, I, I annihilated my bosses. Right? The hell does that mean? Annihilated. I got rid of all of them. You don't like that word? No, not for well, that. Not, what, what word should I use? I just, I was objective. I was being impartial, and I looked at the evidence. How about this annihilating boss? It doesn't make it. Well, that do, yours does sound cleaner. It's short and concise. I like that. What should I say? 
I'm being objective. I'm being impartial. Okay. Okay. I'm going to say that. I'll, I'm being objective. I'm being impartial. You know? I'm using both sides of my brain is what I'm trying to tell you. Oh, man. I can... Like, sexual deviants, they all got this, this gaze when you look at them. They got a, like, you know, got like, aura about them. Yeah, like a gay person. Yeah, like that a, mannerism. Like, have you ever been, like, walking somewhere, and for whatever reason, a gay guy comes out, and he's flaming gay, and y'all meet eyes? So you look at him like, oh, God. Hey, man, why you had to go there? Now, haven't you ever, like, locked eyes with a real gay person? Like, they can't... Well, what is a real gay person? I mean, flamboyant. I mean, they're gay. They're, they're so gay, they want everybody to know they're gay just by looking at them. A semen dumpster. Is that what you're saying? Yeah. You're a toxic gay. Yeah, toxic gay. Now, don't that sound bad? Haven't you ever... Toxic gay? Yeah. Haven't you ever... Use locked... that next time. Like, you help me with my language. Hey, stop cutting me off. You help me, I help with yours. Okay. Use toxic gayness. Yeah. Haven't you ever, like, locked eyes with a toxically gay person? Yeah. And it's like, it's like, it's like triggering. It's like, it puts chills up your spine. Man, that sounds ha hateful and homophobic. <laughs> no, you'd be like, oh. <laughs> you, you ain't a, come on, we was just at the mall bar two months ago. That dude came out, and he walked back. I said, man, that dude was gay. We came around, looked there. Dude was wearing panties, and he had these see-through shorts. Yeah, he was toxic. And he came out of the bathroom doing this. Yep. Know what he was doing. Hey, Kevin. Um, What? What? I mean, but I kind of believe him. I believe him. It's a good excuse. But he had a long time to come up with that excuse. <laughs> I'm traveling with my family and kids. <laughs> We're going to Florida. We're going to do some fossil hunting. <laughs> Who wouldn't believe that? You see, uh, Jesse Waters. Who the hell goes just, fossil uh, hunting? Uh, uh, Who uh, looks for fossils? Uh, <laughs> I've never been fossil hunting. Never. Ne the, the idea never even came to me. Hey, honey, you know what? You want to go out and fossil hunt? <laughs> Yeah, you see Jesse Waters looking at him? Jesse was like this. He was eyeing him down. <laughs> I think yeah. he's telling the truth, though, man. He doesn't look like a pedo to me. What is pet? Kevin, they come just in like all said, shapes Keith, and sizes. You can look at a person. You just said it three minutes ago. Don't contradict yourself. <laughs> you can look at a person, and you, they have this or this stigma around them. You can tell a sexual demon. You just said that. Three minutes ago. Yeah, I said it, yeah. 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 See? Thanks for pointing that out. Yeah. I don't like You got to stay objective. You always remember that. You got to stay objective. Yeah, I don't want to be a hypocrite. Yeah, you don't want to be a hypocrite. But I couldn't vote for um, RFK Jr. It's, just, it's exhausting just listening to him talk. You I know think, what? I forgot the issue he has, but it's just, could you imagine like a... Well, he has a uh, He addressed the nation, and it's like, I can't, I can't... No, I, I can deal with it if he gets elected. I can't. Because I'm a good human being. No, I've had enough Democrats getting elected. That's enough. We don't need no more Democrats. I mean, if, the it, if it came down to it, if if you can live with Joe Biden, you can live with earthquake boys. You You're going to get a Democrat that admits that being on the plane with Jeffrey Epstein? Well, yeah, he, he said it was fossil hunting. You don't believe him? The dude was fossil hunting with the kids. He didn't know him. His wife knew him. Giselle, that's why I said his wife needs to be investigated. She might be living a double life. And JFK nobody. don't know about it. He ain't even released the damn, the, the, the daggone Johns, man. He ain't releasing nothing. That's why he he was on there. That's all kinds of, he ain't never releasing that. You know what I'm going to do this weekend? What? I'm going to go fossil hunting. Hey, we got a new giveaway going. We give away a Ford 350 and 10,000 cash. Then in the win, go to fisherhawkstwins.com. Anything you buy on the site gets you automatically in the win. Fossil hunt. Yeah.